is a health disparity. So let's um, first describe what is a disparity. A disparity is defined as a significant difference. And when we think about it in the healthcare context, that's differences in health outcomes, and usually it's by different factors such as sexual orientation, disability status. Um, but for the purposes of this panel, and usually what's brought up in the literature is differences or disparities by race and ethnicity. And thank you for that, Dr. Luisius. And, and I'd also like to add, um, you know, when I think about health disparities, I also think about the CDC's definition, which places a heavy emphasis, emphasis on uh, the fact that these are preventable differences often seen in uh, so, so socially disadvantaged uh, groups. And as Dr. Luisia has mentioned, there are many different groups, one of which can be low income group or uh, racial and ethnic uh, minorities. And, and we have to remember that those are two distinct uh, groups that can overlap, but don't necessarily overlap. And, and even high income individuals um, from racial and ethnic um, minority groups can uh, experience uh, disparities. Uh, due to racism and, and access or poor access to high quality care. Okay, thank you, Dr. Rice. And when I think of uh, health disparity, I think of disparities that can impact our actions or the actions we don't take. For instance, in the clinical trial context, such as uh, not recruiting a patient into a trial because of implicit bias or assumptions about the patient's capabilities based on um, their race, ethnicity, or other uh, characteristics, or um, not uh, ensuring that patients from a certain area, uh, a certain population are recruited into clinical trials uh, adequately, whether uh, it's done deliberately or inadvertently. All of those are actions uh, that lead to uh, overall healthcare disparities. I think everyone summed it up really nicely. I think what we'll all add uh, in terms of the work that I do, uh, health disparities really um, uh, come up in the way we deliver healthcare. So as, as technology plays an increasing role in, in healthcare delivery, the way I see health disparities is, is uh, the way how people access these, uh, these tools, whether it's having access to the internet or whether accessing to telemedicine or patient portals or mobile apps. Increasingly, we're seeing that uh, patients from uh, low socioeconomic status or racial ethnic minorities are often uh, less likely or, or have less access to these tools. And that, you know, not only kind of creates these digital disparities, but kind of down the line leads to um, the health disparities that my, that my colleagues have so, so nicely uh, summarized. Mm -hmm.